You stepped into my forest, and now you must. What if the Snatcher disguised the prince in a dwell or outfit in order for his minions not to be familiar with him? Is this necessary? My minions will eat you if you look human. What? Awkward conversation when past prince tries to slash asks to go see Vanessa. This can't be Subcon. Vanessa would never allow our home to become this. What aren't you telling me? Did you have anything to do with this? Why does everybody I talk to run at the mere mention of her name? Where is Vanessa? Oh, don't you dare hide behind that comically large book. Will you look at me and give me a straight answer for once? Where is she? I want to talk to Vanessa. The Vanessa you know is dead. What do the Subcanites think of the prince? Are they suspicious of him at all? Have you met the new guy yet? Yeah, he's really nice. Do you feel like there's something familiar about him? Familiar... how? Eh, like there's something about him we haven't had around here in a long time. Optimism? Charisma? Oh, someone who actually listens to our problems? He's like... the sun. How does the prince react to some of the spirits in Subkin? <laughs> oh, uh, hello there. I don't believe I've heard about your manner of spirit before. I know there are quite a few different kinds in the forest. <laughs> this is fun. Is Hat Kid still on this planet in this AU? It's only a matter of time before Hat and Bo come knocking. What happens then? Uh, should we be worried? Nah, this is just one of my BFF's traps. And that's a good thing? Not really. You again? I thought I told you. Hey, kiddo. How'd you like to help your... Uh, BFF with something? All I can think about is the prince following Snatcher around trying to keep him from collecting souls. That's what you mean when you say you're going to work? And that's why I don't bring you along. Does Hat Kid recognize the prince from Vanessa's book? Ah, hello there. Hmm? <gasps> Can you show me how to be a princess? Well, I suppose. Let's go outside. See, so teach you how to talk to animals, like in the movies. What? Bye, guys. Have fun. Tell me everything right now. Yeah. That's everything that's happened so far. Okay, I have good news and bad news. What's the good news? The good news is it is possible to bring him back to the past. And the bad news? One of you might cease to exist. What? Hey, it's a miracle that isn't causing more damage. He's here because of a timepiece that's given us a bumper to work with. But it's only a matter of time before the power key of here, Paradox Free, starts to fade. Why can't you just return him to the past? He'd make different choices because of what he's seen here. Memories shape a person in every little decision they make. Snatcher, you don't remember any of this happening to you? No. That's because right now the timeline sees you as two separate entities. If he were to return to the past and resume his role, you get his memories for however long you kept existing before the timeline gets rewritten, and he takes your place in whatever new present gets created. And if he stays? He'll die. The power of time beast keeping him here will fade. He'll become an anomaly and cease to exist while a new instance takes his place. For whatever moment on the timeline he was pulled from, it'd be like none of this ever happened. It's one, him or two, you, three. Snatcher. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. I'm so sorry. That's it. You're a fast learner. Is the prince afraid Snatcher will attack him even though he hasn't yet? Why? Whatever is the matter, your highness? You look nervous. Could it perhaps be... this? How did the prince get into the Paradox Universe? Oh. I hope Snatcher is at least taking some care of the prince. There. Happy? Mm-hmm. Good. 
I turn my back for two minutes, and the next thing I know, you're about to poison yourself. Your fault for not helping me find something to eat when I first asked. What if the prince finds the giant well and looks around? Why is this well so big? Oh, now that's actually a very interesting piece of history. This well was the first man-made structure built here. The pipe work was ahead of its time and served as I the foundation for ask the first for a history lesson. region. Does the prince have any theories on what's going on? Time magic? Curse? Demon? Ghost? Something else? Ruins? Vanessa? Why is he keeping me alive if he hates me? What does he need me for? What happened to my home? Tragedy? Attack? Accident? This is the future. The royal families are all long dead. Which means their magic must have died along with them. Could it be that he wants... <gasps> Hopefully the prince doesn't notice that his shadow looks exactly like the Snatcher. <sighs> you didn't actually think you could hide from me. Did ya? Is he concerned that if Snatcher knows his name, he'll be able to take his magic too? This is your real name, Ritania. Yes? What kind of magic does the prince have? The magic belonging to the royal families of old is legendary, passing down great power from generation to generation. However, our dear prince does not have open access to the wellspring of power within him, at least. Not until it consumed him. Snatcher ever try to get the prince to try a soul? Stop eating souls. <laughs> no. Your fault for not helping me find something to eat when I first asked. Bitch. <laughs> Why is this well so big? <laughs> what was that, dude? Never do that voice again. I did not ask for a history lesson. Gringo estupido. <laughs> hey, it's a miracle that this isn't causing more damage. Since he's here because of a timepiece, it's giving us a buffer to work with. But it's only a matter of time before the power... No! Oh, I was so close. Fuck. You know that this is only because of my chicken nugget debt, okay? <laughs>